everyone. In this video, I'll be reading a fanfic titled, Guess His Fight, Flight, or Freeze Response is blank. And this is a crossover of the show's Good Luck Charlie, Lab Rats Elite Force, Cory in the House, and the movie Minutemen. Now, I realize the way I film my, uh, way I put my phone will depend on if the longer sentences are cut off or not. So, I've put it the right way this time. <laughs> this is take three. Um, okay. Guess his fight, flight, or freeze response is blank. Now, audio now complete, which is what I'm currently doing. And if you want to read this part, I'll give you a sec. <laughs> Gosh. Oh, my cat's beside me and she just did, like, a really cute stretch. It was so cute. Um, all right. <laughs> okay. All right. She just hit me because I went to go pet her. <laughs> anyway. I've uh, given you some time to read that. If you want to read this part, go ahead. I'll give you a sec. If you need any more, you can pause and read that. Oops. Wrong button. <clears throat> okay, you want to read that. If you need any more time, go ahead and pause. Okay. And I figure I'll probably do some edits um, for typing um, while I make this video. But I am filming it on the 29th. Um, and this is the first November video. And I don't have any... <laughs> and it, I mean, it's the 29th. I, I kind of need to uh, get my uh, button gear here um, and <laughs> start recording these. Um, but anyway, here I am. Guess his fight, flight, or freeze response is blank. All right. In the penthouse uh, suite in Davenportia. I hope that's right. I've only watched the show once. I'm the spin-off um, crossover series once. So if I'm wrong, you can correct me in the comments. Um, in the Elite Force, Chase has just gotten their attention. They're all in the living room area and are looking at Chase. As you can tell, I have a curtain wall. Each emoji is where the um, page ended kind of thing. Um, so... This one doesn't count because it's kind of like, because it was like halfway down the page when I started it. Um, so that's not like a full page. Um, this superhero to this superhero is not a full page. It was because it was halfway down the page when I started um, from the previous story. Um, so that's why it's so short here. Uh, but anyway, uh, that's just why I have the little emojis there, because it was, like, a sign that, okay, this is a new page, this is a new page, a new page. Um, so that was, when I was going back to edit, if I forgot a line, um, when I did the digital photo and, uh, copy, um, <laughs> copy and paste it with a digital photo of the text, um, then I knew, okay, well, that's, you know, that's this page. So, anyway, or that's that many pages into the story kind of thing. Anyway, uh, point is... Uh, I'm going to get back to it. You know what? I'm going to get back to on topic. I have ADHD. I get distracted easily. So fair warning <laughs> um, and everything uh, that this would go quicker if I didn't get distracted as easily as I do. But anyway, let's get on with the story now. As you can tell, I have a curtain wall. Behind it is our new chef, our new personal chef. As you know, we've needed one for the past few months. Kaz points out, well, that was Chase saying that. Kaz points out, but how can we trust a stranger to keep our secret? Chase answers, Well, it just so happens he's one of the Minutemen, and he has, and he comes from a big family. After I scanned him, turns out none of his family members knows, uh, knows he was a superhero. And then Kaz whispers behind the curtain wall, You can come out now, Virgil. A few minutes later, it erased the dash for some reason. Um, when I went to go edit this with Grammarly, the dash got erased there. But there's supposed to be a dash in between MMJ and here. Let's see. Okay. All right. I'm just going to leave it. Anyway, on with the story now. Uh, a few minutes later, Chase introduces... Virgil, this is Skylar, Bree, Oliver, and you know me. Wait, where's Kaz? 
forgot there's a space here. Wait, where's Kaz? Realization hits. Oliver points out, guess we know his fight, flight, or freeze response is flight. Knowingly points up to show Kaz on the ceiling. Skylar confused. Sorry, what do you mean by fight, flight, or freeze? I'm, I apologize. I'm Canadian, so sometimes it shows in these videos. Um, that's just how I talk. You know, and sometimes I don't even realize, oh, my Canadian showing and this is not a Canadian show. Yikes. All right. My bad. But what can you do? Too late now. Um, <laughs> oh, my cat's rolling around beside me being cute um, and distracting me. Yeah, I'm talking to you. <laughs> She's just looking at me. <laughs> All right. Skylar says, sorry, what do you mean by fight, flight or freeze? Oliver answers, oh, uh, humans like to use fight, flight, or freeze to describe how they handle a crisis. Flight can mean they get defensive, or fight can mean, sorry, fight. Let's try this again. Fight can mean they can get defensive, or in some cases can be a physical fight. Flight usually refers to when you flee or leave the scene. Um, but in this case, flight means literal, literally flight. Um, it, uh, grammarly, um, erased literally because it's not grammatically correct or whatever, uh, it is, but, um, I had it saying, in this case, it literally means flight, um, but it got autocorrected with grammarly. Uh, anyway, now the last one, freeze, not many people know about, but it's kind of self-explanatory. You kind of freeze where you are or, like, in that situation, um, and it could also look like, like, just being very still and stuff, different things like that. Does that answer your questions? I, I hope I did a good description in this video, but if not, you can always, uh, look up, it, look up more online, you know. I was just trying to summarize it as best as I could. Um, Skylar explains, yes, it does. Great, says Oliver. Kaz brings up, now to address the Kaz on on the ceiling. See what I did there? <laughs> I, I tried to make a joke. I don't know if it landed there. Um, anyway, Kaz, what are you doing on the ceiling? Says Chance, or Chase. Chance is another series. Uh, Chase, says Chase. Um, uh, Kaz lying. I'm chilling. I mean, I have the powers. Why not use them? <laughs> Chase. Uh, certain. Though I think that was spelled wrong. Oh, well. I'm gonna ignore it. <laughs> you can correct it in the comments if it bothers you. You're lying, aren't you? No. You're lying. No. What was I trying to say there? Oh, okay, now I remember what I was saying there. Um, I was trying to think. Okay, let's go. Let's click this. Hey, or... No. Let's go. You're lying. You're lying, says Chase. Sorry, it took me a minute to figure out what I was trying to say there because, you know, I had forgotten what I had written down originally <laughs> in that spot. Kaz derailing. Did you just scan me without my permission? 
<laughs> Chase uh, confesses. Yes, sorry. Did... Wait. Wait, I know what you're doing. You're derailing the conversation. Kazmitz, I had to try. Now, could you come down here and meet our guests? Says Chase. Nah, I'm going to stay up here for now. Chase, sarcastically. Ha ha, very funny. Now come meet our guests. <sighs> Kaz, nicely. Thanks, I'd rather not. <laughs> Chase uh, requests. Oliver, would ya? Oliver is now up with Kaz. So, uh, Oliver asks quietly. So what's the real reason you don't want to meet the guest? <sighs> Kaz uh, confesses. Because my oldest brother and I never told the family about our superhero thing. Oh, so that's why you're up here. <sighs> but I'm sure he'll understand. I mean, he was also a superhero. <laughs> okay, fair. Uh, okay, I'll admit I often confuse the spelling of supper and super. So I really hope I got it right. <laughs> it's like the difference between one extra letter and I always mix it up in my mind. So I really hope I'm getting this uh, the spelling right. Um, but anyway, on with the story. Kaz realizes, well, that's a good point. <laughs> um, now both Oliver and Kaz have, are coming down. Kaz is ready, readying himself for what PJ is about to say when he finds out. PJ reacts, Gabe, is that you? Kaz reveals, yes, it's me. The more important thing is, why are you telling people your name is Virgil? Oh my gosh. It's supposed to be Virgil, but it auto-corrected. Think that's right? Okay. Why are you telling people your name is Virgil when we both know it's PJ, huh? Just then, Leo and Janelle walk in for a surprise visit. Sophie? Is that you? asked PJ. Sophie surprised. Newt, what are you doing here? PJ uh, responds with, I'm their new personal chef. What are you doing here? Sophie reveals. That's another mistake of where our E reveals. That's what the computer thought I was spelling. That's another one where the computer thought I was spelling something that I wasn't spelling. Okay, Sophie says, my boyfriend Leo is Bree and Chase's stepbrother. PJ and, uh, happily says, interesting. Uh -huh. Hi. Um, PJ nicely says, uh, hi Leo, I'm, I'm Newt. Bree explains confused. Now I'm the fastest person on earth, but I'm having a hard time keeping up here. So what's, so is your name Janelle or Sophie? And is your name... Newt P.J. Virgil. And is your name Gabe or Kaz? Janelle uh, suggests, uh, I'll go first. My real name is Sophie. I changed it because my dad was the president of the United States when I was younger. And press can be really hard on a child. Kaz uh, responds with, I'll go next. First, I have to applaud you, P.J. You managed to keep the Minutemen secret from all our siblings and, and our parents. And now, and I now know how hard that is to do. So congrats. Thanks, bro. I appreciate that. <laughs> Bree realizes, wait, you two are brothers? PJ and Gabe says, yes, we are. That's why I was on the ceiling earlier. That's supposed to be on a different line. Another picture slide. When I was doing this with photos. <sighs> That's what my abbreviation was. Um, that's why I was on the ceiling earlier. And my real name is Gabe, says Kaz. Uh, Kaz reveals, I lied so that I already had a superhero name. And I thought that before I became a superhero, just in case. And sure enough, I did need it. PJ apologizes. Now, I'm sorry for lying. My real name is PJ. Now, I didn't want people to tease me about how much my parents made. This is him. He looks at Sophie. So I told them they were famous politicians. Uh, PJ confesses. In reality, my dad's a pest exter exterminator 
and my mom's a doctor at the hospital in Denver. I'm sorry I lied. So after this, I added this little bit because I'm like, then I was like saying, well, they're all happy. There's no more secrets between each other. And I'm like, it seems like it stops too quickly. So I needed to add something. So this is a addition after I made all the edits. Um, like this is not in the like original copy. So anyway, Oliver realizes, so Kaz is just following in his mother's footsteps. PJ confused. How so? Gabe reveals, me and Oliver used to work in a top secret superhero hospital called Mighty Med, where we used to, we used our comic book knowledge to help save injured superheroes. Wow, I never would have guessed Gabe would be the one to follow in mom's footsteps. But that's awesome, bro. This is PJ. Gabe appreciates, says, thank you. I'm honestly so happy you're going to be our chef. Guys, my brother's a great cook and became one since our mom was a bad cook. <laughs> Not for lack of trying. She just didn't get that skill. <laughs> PJ clarifying. So you're okay with me joining you at your workplace and you're not upset I'm at your getaway from the family place? Gabe reveals, in all fairness, you are not one of the siblings that usually gets, that usually annoys me. <sighs> That's a relief, says PJ. Well, any suggestions for the last, for the first, sorry, for the first meal I make here? Gabe responds with, my favorite thing you make are your burgers. They're the best burgers I've ever had, says Gabe. Then, uh, then when you get back from your mission, I'll have them ready for you. Quick question. Do I need to make any vegan burgers? Bree responds, yes, I am vegan. But no one else is. All right. You go save the world while I prepare my famous burgers, says PJ. So PJ does that. And as they complete their mission, uh, does that as they complete their mission, everyone is shocked at how good the burgers are. Gabe knowingly says, see, I told you they were good. Bree informs, and you weren't joking. Yeah, these are so good, I might move in, says Leo. Janelle gives Leo a look. I mean, I would if I could, but I have a job to do, so I can't. <laughs> uh, three hours later, everyone apologizes for their lies and are all forgiven for lying. Everyone's happy. There's no more secrets between them. The end of Guess His Fight, Flight, or Freeze response is blank. <sighs> Hope you enjoyed this story. What inspired this fanfic? I thought it would be funny if Gabe Dash Kaz saw PJ at the Leap Force headquarters out of fear and out of fear took the flight part of fight, flight, or freeze response literally. Since Kaz and Oliver are now able to fly, and that was what inspired this fanfic. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I hope you have a fantastic day. Thank you for watching. This uh, was edited and spell checked from October 19, 2024 at 11.47 p.m. to October 29th at 5.40 eight what five forty eight p.m make sure to have a fantastic day thank you for watching i really appreciate it if you made it this far comment a superhero emoji in the comment in the comment section